Hey there friends, today we're going to be resetting this CenturyLink router. Here is the model number, the C1100Z, and it's actually made by this maker right here, ZYXEL, and uh, it's a very, very simple process. I'm going to show you how to do it right now. Okay, so for this job, all we're really going to need is a, a pin. This is actually an older uh, SIM card removal tool that came with an old iPhone. So I'm just going to be using uh, that to keep them handy. If you need something like that, you want to order off at Amazon, I'll put a little link in the description box below. Uh, basically, I'm going to swing this around here and we can check out the back. Now, again, what we're going to be doing here is doing a hard reset. This resets all of your uh, the naming scheme that you have on the router as well as your uh, custom password that you may have set up. Now, there, you can see there's a little reset circle right here. What we're going to do is we're going to take that pin and we're going to stick it directly into uh, this area and hold down for about 15 seconds. Now, the default password you're most likely going to find right here on the back of the router or underneath the router. I'm not going to show you that just because this is a very custom uh, password for this specific router. But make sure you have that written down somewhere or know how to access it if it's not directly located on the router because you're gonna need that if you want to set things up again. Again, what we're doing is setting things up to factory default settings. So I'm gonna actually stick this in there. I'm gonna push down again on that little button. You'll feel it depress. And I'm gonna hold it for 15 seconds. And on the front of the router, if you're looking at the front, you're actually gonna see the lights recycle. And uh, once they recycle, you'll know that you can release the, uh, the little button here. That should be long enough. And we'll flip this around here. And again, you can see that the lights that were on below, again, I don't have this plugged in. This is just simply uh, powered on with uh, electricity. You can see that the power is now recycling and it's gonna be looking for uh, connections after that. So this reset was successful. Again, if you'd like to now reset the password and rename the, uh, the router to something more custom, I'll show you a link how to do that in the description box below. Friends, thanks so much for watching. Take care and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Hit that thumbs up if this has helped and uh, subscribe. we got a lot more videos coming up soon. Thanks so much.